Our big story tonight, two teenagers killed in a police chase in Waukesha County. The 12 News has learned the 17-year-old girl and 18-year-old woman died when police say their car left the road near Martin and National in New Berlin around 10.30 last night. 12 News' Nick Bohr is live at the scene. Nick, you've obtained video in which the incident is clearly her. Right, Patrick, and you can see where that ended here in some brush here at the end of Martin Road. This all started about two miles away when Muskego police tried to pull a vehicle over, but instead that driver took off. When Yanni Harris's surveillance system started sending him activity alerts around 1030 Sunday night, he took a look and then a listen. There was a ton of squad cars outside, so I kind of backed it up a little bit. And that's where I could, on the, on the video, I could hear a um, car moving at extremely high rate of speed, tires screeching, a lot of, a lot of loud uh, noises, we'll put it that way. It sounded like a rollover and then a crash, and then the horn was just stuck. Though the crash isn't seen, Haro says it certainly sounded like a pursuit. Muskego police say the occupants of the car were spotted near Idle Isle Park engaging in, quote, suspicious behavior, though so far police aren't explaining what that was. When police tried to pull them over a few blocks away, they say the car took off at high speed on Martin Road. Two miles later, the violent crash, leaving a 17-year-old girl and 18-year-old woman dead and two others in the car injured. According to Muskego police, that car was traveling this direction on Martin Road where it crossed National Avenue and into this grass. You can see tire tracks here as it went through this heavy brush and slammed right into this white building here behind me. Knowing somebody died here, I mean, you're not surprised. Oh, I mean, it's it definitely sounded extremely violent and obviously it's very, very sad to hear that. And Nick, Muskego police stopped short of calling this a pursuit. They did simply say in their release today, quote, they later located the crash after the vehicle sped away from that attempted traffic stop. But in that video, the sirens are clearly heard very nearby when that crash occurred. The Wisconsin State Patrol is investigating the crash.